Hi, this is Anil from Learning Lad Education with a quick tutorial on uh, how to write a program to check whether a number is an even number or a odd number. So a number is said to be even number, you know, if it is completely divisible by two or, you know, in other words, you know, when we divide a number by two and uh, at that time, if we get the reminder as zero, then it's going to mean that that number is even number. You know, if we get any other value as a reminder, then it's going to mean that, you know, that number is not an even number, you know, which is a odd number. So here, for example, let's say, you know, we're going to have the number um, six. So to check whether this number is even number or odd number, you know, we're going to divide this number by two. So at that time, you know, if it gives the reminder as zero, you know, as here in this case, if the reminder is zero, then the number is even number else, you know, the number is odd number. So here in this tutorial, we're going to use the modulus operator to get the reminder, you know, when we divide the entered number by two, and then we're going to compare that reminder value, you know, whether that one is zero or not. And depending on that comparison, we're going to print out whether that number is even number or odd number. So here, uh, what we're going to do is, you know, we're going to ask the user to enter the number and then we're going to check that number and then, you know, we're going to print out the appropriate message. So here we need a variable to store the value entered by the user. So I'm going to create an integer variable and uh, let's say int and I'm going to call it as number. And then we're going to ask the user to enter the number to check whether it is even or odd. So I'm going to use a printf function and I'm going to say enter the number to check even or odd. And then I'm going to add a new line, you know, just to make it pretty. And then we're going to receive the value entered by the user. So I'm going to use the scanf function and we're going to use the form specifier as percentage %d because we are receiving an integer value. And then we're going to store that in our number variable and we need to use the ampersand symbol here. And then the next thing that we're going to do is you're going to use the mod operator to get the reminder, you know, when we divide the value stored in this number variable by two. And depending on the outcome of that operation, you know, we're going to print out some appropriate message. So I'm going to use the if statement and I'm going to write number mod two. And then uh, let's have a bracket here, you know, just to um, make it more uh, easy to read. And then we're going to compare that value, whether number mod two is equal to zero. If it is so, then it's going to mean that the number is even number else the number is a odd number. So here we're just going to use a printf statement. So it's going to be printf and we're going to say percentage D is even number. And we need to refer the variable number. And I'm going to copy this whole printf statement and I'm going to paste that in this else part. And here we're going to say odd number. That's it. And the last thing that we're going to do is, you know, we're going to run this program. So I'm going to go to build, build and run. And it says enter the number to check even or odd. So I'm just going to enter six and I'm going to hit enter button. And it says six is even number. And I'm just going to run this program again. And again, you know, it says enter the number to check even or odd. I'm going to enter three and I'm going to hit enter and it says three is odd number. So this is how you guys can write a program in C to check whether the number is even number or odd number. You can get the source code of this tutorial in my website learninglad.com and also you guys can like my Facebook page at uh, facebook.com slash learninglad and also you guys can follow us on Twitter and I'll see you in the next tutorial.